Good morning, everybody. It's your favorite aspiring revolutionary, a wandering author here, reminding you that we are all the authors of our own lives. As always, my message remains the same. Spend less, live more, earn your freedom with frugality. Today, we are walking through the Valley of the Giants Trail near Distillery Bend in Beckley Creek. And I've got some real life inspiration for y'all today. So, every cent you spend matters is a Brazilian ethos. And I learned it from my stepfather, who can be incredibly difficult to get along with, but he does care immensely about his family. And the reason why his story deserves to be heard is because this man dropped out of school in fourth grade, but he retired at 35, owning a home in America outright, and an entire farm in Brazil he paid off his mom's house in Brazil. He helped his brothers build a business in Brazil that continues to support them down there. And today he spends most of the year farming cattle on his farm, just like he wanted to ever since he was a child. How did he do that? <clears throat> well, in Brazil, it's not like it here in America where we can afford to be wasteful. And the truth is, we really can't afford to be wasteful here, especially with inflation as high as it is. From paper towels to toothpaste, this is a man who's never wasted a thing. I'm talking every aspect of his life. If a spill happened, he would only use one, one sheet of a paper towel. And once the toothpaste is empty he would actually cut open the tube and he continues to do that today when i was a child growing up in high school it didn't make any sense to me because it's so different from what we experience in our culture as americans but the thing is is we've all been disempowered and this man achieved far more than most americans do with far less and he did that just by being intentional with his spending incredibly and he embodies it in his entire life all this travel that i'm doing to try and inspire a revolution of consciousness it's only possible because i'm incredibly intentional too and i think we all should be because it would give us our power back <clears throat> so what are you wasting how can you cut back on your spending and what do you want to accomplish? Do you need to find clarity to be able to do that? But if a man with fourth grade education from Brazil can set his family up with financial freedom, all of us can. So my question for you guys is, as always, what are you doing to inspire, uplift, and empower your local community today? Because you're watching me, and the world's only going to change if we all do our part. <laughs>